A frightening situation unfolded yesterday at Hellgate High School as parents of students were notified of a potential firearm threat to campus, prompting the school to go into a lockdown. This all happened around 1.30 p.m. Students and staff tell MTN's Megan Mannering that the situation was traumatic. Well, I was in building trades and we went to lockdown and we had to all get against the wall and we shoved tables in front of the um, classroom doors and we all sat and just stay quiet for about 30 minutes. Thursday marked only the third day of high school for freshman Elizabeth Frank. Less than a week into the semester, she and the rest of her peers experienced this. Uh, we had a student come to us and report that two other students had told him that they were in possession of a firearm and that they were planning to do some sort of, um, that they were going to use the firearm in some way. In less than a minute, the entire school was in lockdown. Two minutes later, law enforcement arrived on scene. We used our cameras to identify the students who made the initial uh, threat. For almost 90 minutes, students remained in lockdown mode. But like muscle memory, they did what they were told and kept their composure. My first thought was to text my mom, and I tell, told her what happened, and my dad checked with me. And I just stayed calm because I knew that was the best thing to do. Three juveniles associated with the threat are currently being detained and their parents are being contacted for continued investigation. Principal Judson Miller says, unfortunately, this is a protocol that they know and a protocol that they practice. And in his mind, today was a great response to a traumatic event. Uh, when we get a report like that, unfortunately, there's just a protocol that we work through. So it's just immediate, like next step, next step, next step. Um, and we work through that. Um, the first thing that I told our students in the assembly is that they were safe and I thanked our entire school for um, being calm, working through our protocols. I mean, it's only day, what are we, day three right now? And um, obviously we haven't practiced this and everything went as well as it could have gone. In Missoula, Megan Mannering, MTN News. We do not know the status right now of those three students who were detained. And again, classes only started on Monday.